<clears throat> oh. And testing. One, two, three. By the dawn's early light. All right. Welcome, my friends. It is now November, and it is election week, so we're rolling back. We rolled back the clocks. I usually release these on a Monday, and I uh, just got back from doing some outside work. I've been uh, doing a lot of stuff around the house, Halloween parties, work, pickleball, just a little bit of building. You may have seen my video this last week where I did the Creator 3-in-1. It was a follow-up. Uh, to the haul. Um, this week I will have another haul, so stay tuned. I really, and I thought about it, I should have done it in costume, wanted to release it, but I, you know, I just miss these uh, areas of opportunities, if you will. So, but with that, this episode is going to be focused about forward. I'm not going to spend, a, this is going to be a short episode because one of the things I want you to do is uh, <laughs> keep watching the video. However, I want you to go out and vote. This one, if you want us to, uh, you know, again, live in this free democ democracy where I can just do what I want, buy my Lego, work hard, play hard, essentially, is my motto, you have to go out and vote. And if you are under 18 and not able to vote, encourage your parents, encourage your other family that may be over 18 and uh, to educate themselves Make sure to educate yourself. Don't just randomly select names. Go out there and look at the people's uh, character uh, and vote. So get out there and uh, you know make a decision for yourself. Because either way you vote, that's okay. You then can complain about it afterwards. And believe me, in my life, I, I, I can definitely complain about those types of things. But I'm also one to look at both sides, and uh, uh, I, I've never, and I probably will never explore politics in this channel, but the one thing I can do with this platform is say, go out there and vote. Don't screw it up, America. Go out there and vote. Hey, and if whatever happens, happens, and if you voted, then, you know, it's, hey, that's, uh, we, we did our jobs. So that is it for that. What I will say again is that I will be releasing reviews on the 3-in-1. I have a review coming on this bad boy. It's been a long time coming. I usually try to pair them together, but excuse me, but it hasn't uh, been able to pan out. I'm really excited to see how the 3-in-1 video turns out. This is the first time I've been able to build... Normally, I have to build them on separate videos, so I'll do one, a video on one, another video on another, and then I kind of do like a, a review, but it's all broken down. I can only show one at a time, and so in this case, I'm able to show all three builds, bam, uh, in one shot. Oh, there goes the pumpkin. Actually, it's not Halloween technically anymore. Um, in fact, outside, I just took down a lot of my uh, decorations. So we'll put that aside. I have a ton of cleaning uh, to do. Just so much sorting. It's just, uh, you know, that that is the name of the game is that it's sorting. But the headline for today is back to building, back to fall. Uh, Packers are doing well, although they've been kind of struggling with some injuries. Huge game uh, this week with the Lions. The Bears are going to the Cardinals. That's a huge game. Don't know who the Vikings are playing off the top of my head, uh, and I think the following week the uh, Bears Packers play. So this is the last weekend where I'm gonna struggle trying to watch the uh, the Packers game because you know I'm in Illinois, it blocks out on me, which isn't uh, fun. So that is it for this week. Staying really focused. Going to be making sure to knock these videos out. The plan for this is to break down these parts. There's so many good parts, you know, like these uh, these white uh, tile, like half half uh, one by one tiles. Um, it's really good, really good. Or actually, a two by two, half two by two, so like triangle tiles. Um, a lot of these different parts that you can use, especially in ships. These are great. Uh, lots of white, some nice black plating, 
lots of little little parts that can be very useful and so that's uh that has been huge and again this was uh this was free free lego haul um while i uh my budget is in maintenance mode right now i'm hoping coming up here soon i'll be able to open up my budget just a tad um because i've got a lot of things i i, I had invested in uh getting certified as a, a pickleball instructor uh, you know that that set me back like five or six hundred dollars. I need new shoes, new paddles, and so all of these types of things. And the kids are everything is in life is so much more expensive. The heart, the discretionary income for Lego is at its all time low right now, but I'm doing my best uh, to get by. I'll sneak in a few purchases uh, here and there. Hopefully Black Friday is kind of what I'm targeting for my next my next purchase. Kind of get a couple Star Wars sets before. Definitely the ones I feel like have a chance to get hard to get as we head into 2025. Then, of course, the holidays become gifting season. You know, hopefully uh, I can figure out, you know, getting a few of those other sets. There's so many mid-sized sets that I'd like to get uh, on my list within the Star Wars world. And God, I would love to get the Dungeons & Dragons set. I just don't think it's possible at this point. The Sail Barge looks awesome, too. I don't have any space for the Sail Barge. So we really wouldn't be putting it on display. It would just be to get the parts and get the figures. I, I don't know if it's worth it uh, for me. It's But it is a fantastic set. So I, I, I think a lot of people are really going to be... That's going to be a white whale set for a lot of folks. It's very well done. So with that, thank you so much for joining me on my Lego collecting journey. This is the uh, journal entry Monday edition. I try to put these out uh, every week. It's been two weeks, so uh, I'm going to try to keep it more consistent. That's going to be the goal as I head into 2025. So again, thank you for joining on my journey. Make sure to like and subscribe, and we'll catch you next week on another episode of Journal Entry. Bye for now. Let's go.